Good morning, you guys. I have not vlogged since like Christmas. How you doing? I don't even remember how to do this. <laughs> um, we don't really have much of like anything planned today. I think we're gonna go on a little date night tonight. So I'm leaving Honor with a babysitter that like isn't family. Kind of anxious about it. Speaking of Honor, she's gonna be four months on the 13th. Four months, so probably by the time you guys see this vlog, she'll be four months old. That's insane to me, absolutely insane. Also you guys, so this robe, <laughs> Michael got it for me for Christmas and like, I thought I had saw this on the account. Um, it's a Bali robe, Bonnie, Holine, and Ellie Mika. I love them both so much. They just make my heart happy. Um, but yeah, like this robe is amazing too. Like it's amazing. I love it because like they're like half sleeves so you can still like wash bottles, do dishes, everything you need to do. And like it's not too warm, but it's not like it's still going to keep you warm and I'm like a walking advertisement for them. But yes, I love it. So I even like knew that he got it for me. So I even asked him like on Christmas, babe, I thought you got me a Bali robe. And he was like, no, I forgot, and they sold out, so I got this yesterday. Today's the 10th of January. <laughs> He's like, I hid it really well. So well that he even forgot that he got it after I reminded him he got it for me. I just thought that it, like, disappeared or whatever, but yeah. I also really need to go grocery shopping today. We have nothing in the fridge. I was so sick the other day. I thought for sure I was pregnant, and I was like, Lord, I'm not ready to be pregnant if I'm going to be this sick again. <laughs> I just, like, the second I puked, I was like, no, no, I can't do this again. <laughs> oh, but, like, as soon as Honor came out, I was like, yep, five more, at least. <laughs> it's funny how that happens, but the second you're, like, pregnant, you're like, oh, so... I bet I can't anymore. Okay, what? <laughs> I'm not ready. Should we go back to the bottle? Yeah, she just keeps spitting it out. We'll keep practicing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just drinking a bottle since the other stuff didn't go so well. <laughs> huh? yeah. What do you think? You and dad look like ketchup and mustard. <laughs> well, we were gonna go on a date tonight, but it's probably super dark over here. I don't know if you think you can even see me. But, and I can't, it's now like sleet snowing. Yeah. And I don't even know if you'll be able to hear it. But, yeah. Doesn't look like we might go anywhere now. And I guess we're supposed to get how many inches? Six. Six inches. So, I guess we'll just hang out home with Nugget. Yeah. And you know what? That's not a bad night, is it? No. Mm. Nope. We did go grocery shopping, so I guess that's just our date night for t our date for today. For like, shopping, we do love grocery we shopping. Love it. I, grocery shopping is cool. <laughs> it is fun, especially at Hy-Vee, because like, you get all their like fresh stuff. Like, yeah, I spend a lot of time just looking at produce. Yeah. Which I, I realize is me getting older. <laughs> I just love it. Yeah. Like you sent me to get tomatoes, and I was like. Well, I know she wants to grow my tomatoes, but look at these tomatoes on the vine. You don't even like tomatoes. Uh, no, but still, it was fun. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess that was our date for, what, like the month? That was the first time that I've got out of the house besides... Yeah, we could go Sunday. 
if it, yeah, we could go Sunday. I'll see if Leah can watch her on Sunday, but yeah, so I guess this will probably just turn into a weekend vlog since we're not doing anything fun and exciting tonight. Besides, uh, Michael did buy Scooby-Doo, so, the and like the original. 1969. Yeah, so we'll probably watch some of that tonight if we get stuck at home. I was like so irritated because when we were at hy V, there were so many people there. So many people. And now I, I understand. It's because the snowpocalypse is here. So. And for a lot of people to get paid on Thursday to his grocery day. I know, but it was like 11.30 when we went. Yeah. So I didn't think it should be that busy, but it literally was like every aisle we were in someone's way. Hi. Hey. Yeah, and we had our stroller and our cart, so. But at least they have like the mini carts there, so. Made it a little easier. Anyway, so. Yeah, we'll just. We're gonna go to a friend's house tomorrow night and play some board games and stuff. Two friends oh, and then, yeah, and then another friends to just, like, have some, I don't know, what are we doing there? Just hanging out, chit-chatting. Yeah, saying goodbye. Saying goodbye. <laughs> it could sound like he's dying. Um, and then Sunday we'll probably go to church and stuff. So, yeah, that's it for now. Oh, you're so pretty. Oh, now you're going to look at Daddy with the camera. Look at dear. <laughs> look at it snowing. And that very, very fat squirrel. Wow. All the snow. <laughs> what do you think? That's so beautiful. Your grandma Rhonda loves the snow too. Yes, she does. Now you're looking at daddy. Ellie, what do you think of the snow? You don't like the snow, do you? <laughs> Oh, are you over it? Yes, yes. Laugh There's a the criminal in my house. Laugh at the time. Do you wear that to work too? Huh? Do you wear that at work? Let's say, is that would that even be allowed? Oh no. Ba ba la. <laughs> oh, gotta grab the headphones. Yeah. Can't forget those. It is still coming down, guys. Still coming down. Oh, well, I'm kind of in the reflection, so you can't see very well, but that is a light over there. If you can kind of see the snow coming down. So, yeah, because it's only been like, what, two hours since it started snowing? Yeah, it started at like four, and it is, oh wait, no, yeah, it started at like four. So, Michael's going to go plow, plow, you're going to go plow, babe? Gonna go snow blow for t round one. Okay. Round one. And I'm back in my robe because we're not doing day and night anymore. <laughs> oh, it's still daytime. <laughs> what a romantic date night, you snow, snow blowing and me probably watching YouTube videos. Oh, I guess it kind of looks like you plowed. But I love when it's just untouched beautiful snow still snowing so I guess Michael said that that was just like the first one that we're gonna get we're gonna get another one another do you know what time it's supposed to start you should look that up look that up baby what are you doing that's not the witcher nope. wow who are you I don't know, I'm a little peanut sleeping Hello you guys, happy Saturday. Um, I, yes, it doesn't look like Saturday. It looks like the same day that I just ended the other, you know, day because I'm in my robe. But, look at this cutie. <laughs> but I promise that it is a new day. Okay, so I have something that is so heavy on my heart that I just feel like I want to share with you guys. So, I saw this meme. I'll place it here so you guys can see it. But, it just makes me sad. Because, basically in the meme it says that believing in an invisible man who 
lets someone die of hunger, but at the same time cares what people do in bed. And that's... Oh, you guys. Everyone is a sinner. Everyone. Except for Jesus. And I feel like a lot of people call Christians hypocrites because they hold us to a higher standard, which, okay, I understand that. But we are all imperfect people and we are all sinners. Every last one of us. The only person that ever lived that wasn't a sinner was Jesus. And he suffered for us. He took all of our sins and all of the blame away for us so that we could live eternally if we believe in him. And how beautiful is that, you guys? Like, oh, if I can change one life by saying these words to you, I've made a difference. That's all you need to change. That's why God put us here as Christians is to save others. Like he saved everyone. If you believe in him, he saved you. I don't even like taking the blame for not changing the toilet paper roll. And God took the blame and the sin and all of it away for you. And that's so, so beautiful. And that's what makes, I don't know how to say this. I just, I hate it so much. It hurts my heart. I can take it when people call Christians hypocrites because we are, like, I, I try to live my life as best as I can, but I am still human. So human. And that human part of me, it likes to sin because the devil is still very much here. And he wants to take as many people down into that pit with him as he possibly can before Jesus comes and saves the rest of us. Because he doesn't want to suffer alone. He wants to take every last person with us. And I wish that I could just reach into every one of your hearts and show you how beautiful your life can be if you love Jesus. And if you truly, truly accept him. Oh, I know that is really deep for this Saturday morning, but it has just been weighing heavy on my heart. Um, yeah, really deep, but really, really true, guys. Um, yeah, Jesus loves you. Even if you don't reach out to him, he knows who you are. He put you on this earth, and he wants you to come and be a friend to him and a companion, and he wants you to spend eternity with him, you know? My mother-in-law always tells me, or for a long time has told me, that I'm a daughter of the king. Like, not any of that Disney princess stuff. I'm an eternal daughter of the king. and. I used to think I was so cheesy and that she was so weird for saying stuff like that. But once you get it, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. You want that fairy tale, guys? Love Jesus because he's the best king you're ever going to get and he makes you a princess. So just remember that. Yeah. Anyway. On a lighter note, I just got ready. Yo, what are you doing? Um, I'm gonna get this peanut ready to go next. Michael's in the shower. We're gonna go play Settlers of Catan with his friends from work. And then we're also gonna go to a little work thing. I don't, I'm still very anxious vlogging around other people, so I probably won't. If I do any, it'll be on my phone, so the footage might look a little different, the picture quality. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get dressed and stuff, and then. I think it's almost four, so we're gonna get ready to go do that. Oh, I didn't even show you guys how much it snowed. We're supposed to get more snow on Sunday night. So this isn't all we're gonna get. The sun's coming in over here too, so I don't know how good of a quality this is gonna be. But yeah, 
we probably got like three inches maybe we didn't get that much we we're supposed to get six to nine but we got about three oh there's ellie ellie what are you doing little baby <laughs> Good, I would say good morning, but that would be a straight up lie. <laughs> Happy Sunday. It is 4.30 and I'm just picking up the camera. Um, Michael and I were lazy this morning and just watched church instead of going to it. Um, we were out way too late with people last night from his work and we had a good time though. And Honor was a champ. She just slept in her car seat until like... What time to be at home? One? Two? I don't know. It was late. Nice. Yeah. It was, late. it was pretty late. And she did so good. And she still slept till nine. Like, she... We, so first we went and played Settlers of Catan. And we were there and probably till ten. And then we went to another friend's house. And she slept in the car on the way there. And then promptly woke up when we got her out of the car. So she was up from like 10 to 11 and then slept there from 11 to 1 just fine so you said you're good baby yeah and then when we got home at 1 I put her in her jammies and fed her and she went right to sleep until like 9 so yeah yeah it's good stuff huh yeah yeah you're so pretty she will be 4 months on Monday yeah can you believe <laughs> so, yeah, I'm probably, we're really not going to be doing much tonight. A girl I work with is bringing her little boy over because she works overnights just like us. And so we're going to watch him overnight for her. All right, what's up with you? Did you find it? Don't eat her bone, silly boy. She got it from you. Get it. Quick. No, you don't need it. You don't need it, Lou. It's <laughs> Now you're going to eat the pillow? No, don't eat it. Icky. <laughs> No, icky, icky. <laughs> there, Ellie eats it. That's her bone. <laughs> what are you doing, Bubba? Careful. Oh, what are you doing? Say hello. 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 Wow. Say hi. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, so he's coming over at 7.30, and that's really pretty much all we're going to be doing. We also, um, Michael's dad, every, like, New Year as a birthday present to him, because his birthday is on the 3rd, right, of January. We do, like, a goals type of thing, so I really need to get to working on that, because it was due today. So, I'll get to working on that. Honor, how come Grandpa doesn't make you do one yet, huh? Should we talk about your goals? Huh? <laughs> what do you think about that? Uh, yeah. We should work on your goals. Yeah. So, yeah, that's pretty much all we're doing today. Sorry this vlog wasn't very eventful, but that's that. Our life's not super eventful with a four-month-old. It's true. It's true. Look how cute she is. But, yeah, look how cute she is. In her little Minnie Mouse outfit. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe down below if you're new. And we'll see you in the next one. Sincerely, Sissons.